Hey, what's going on guys? Adast here, and today I have a very fun topic to talk about. We have one of the most bizarre things ever. Christians trying to cancel Disney Plus. Now, you, you might be asking yourself, well, why are they doing that? Simple. Because of what they believe. Now, I will show you the clip that I found, and I'll... I'll Obviously, I'll put it up for you guys to watch real quick, but just a little rundown. There's this movie. I don't know what the movie is, but it's a Christmas movie. And in the movie, these kids run out with these little letters in their hands. They're like elves, I think. They come running out, and instead, instead of spelling Santa, they accidentally spelled Satan. So that's the context, I guess, even though you'll see it. But just to let you know beforehand, um, so here's the video. And then I'll talk about it after. Yo, so if y'all haven't seen the dang on Disney Plus Santa Claus and how it says we love Satan, I had to check this myself. Yes, I definitely have some big shoes to fill. Check this. Have big boots to fill. Okay. 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 Look at this. Man, I'm boycotting Disney Plus. I'm deleting my account. I can't rock with them. I can't do this. Nah. Now, I told myself for weeks on end that I shouldn't get into a religious or political conversation because, to be fair, when religion or politics gets into any sort of, you know, conversation, it's always a joke, you know, just huge jokes. But at the same time, I can respect what someone believes. You know, I'm not going to get into it with them. I'm not going to try and have an argument with them uh, at, at this point because I'm done doing that. So whatever you believe in, I'll respect. Just respect me and my beliefs. Because after all, we are in America. This is a video from an American. And America literally is based off freedom of religion. When it was stolen, of course. That being said, if if America really is the country that you know has all these amendments and all this stuff, and one of those laws are freedom of religion, uh, freedom of speech, of course. So, how are we going to place this freedom of religion there if religion is trying to control what we have for our media intake? You know. Like, you are a majority of people. You are a majority of people trying to control what people like and dislike. You see, you see, you see how ironic that is? We are living in a place where religion is freedom. You know, where we're allowed to have our own beliefs. And yet, at the same time, your beliefs are trying to control what other people are allowed to see. You kind of see the irony in that. You kind of see how the, how it's very hypocritical kind of situation. It's just, it's so annoying, man. Like, it, you, you do not control everything that happens. What you believe is not what everyone else believes. You know? Stop trying to control entertainment because you don't like a joke. That's what it was. It was a joke. It was a joke. Is it really that hard? To just say you don't like the joke instead of getting pissed over it and trying to cancel an entire subscription to a service? To something people enjoy using? Really? Because of something you dislike based off of your own beliefs? It just makes no sense. Stop trying to control everything. Just stop. You know, that's one thing I've always disliked about Christians. I, 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 there are a lot of Christian people out there who are genuinely nice people and will respect you as a person no matter your beliefs. But then you have these entitled people that I don't even really consider religious. I just consider them, like, ignorant. I'm, I'm, I'm getting really heated right now. I'm sorry. But it's just annoying. Stop kind of trying to control what people are trying to see and what they enjoy because of your beliefs. That's all I'm saying. I'm out.